Come here, buddy. You want a treat? Come here, you do your trick? Come here. Come here. So he's like a member of the family. He's a big baby. Aladdin the camel is just one of many animals at Mary's Go Round, a traveling petting zoo named after its owner, Mary Cox. Be it alpaca, llama, mini cows, camels, miniature donkeys, goats, everybody. Since 1992, the licensed and insured zoo has traveled to school and church events as well as many family reunions. But for the past few months, COVID-19 has brought their business to a standstill. Pretty much since the shutdown, we've lost all of our Easter events, daycares, school jobs. Um, most summer camps are canceling already. Um, many, many parties. The company spends about $36,000 a year in hay. We've lost all of our income that would have paid for our hay come June, which would have been our hay for summer, fall, and winter to carry us through. So we've lost all that income as of now. Um, if things don't start picking up, you know, and we don't get busy making money, it'll be, and we spend about 22000 a year on grains, so then it'll be, you know, how do you buy your hay and your grain? The business has always carried hand sanitizer to their events, and it's easy to social distance because they're outdoors. Today, parents lift their own children onto the ponies and other animals. There are other ways the business has had to adapt to the coronavirus as well. Um, now when we go to events, we're going to be wearing masks. Um, instead of giving the kids, I usually take feed and give it to them in their hands from my hand. We're taking little measuring cups and dipping it into the feed and then we're putting it in the children's hands through the little cup, measuring cup, instead of hand-to-hand -hand contact. Mary worries that the impact to her business could continue until the end of the year. They all go to church jobs, we do live nativities, we do the National Cathedral in December, we do lots of big churches. So and they're not even sure if big events are going to be open, you know, in December for church events like that either.